Hey guys, this is Junior Trader, and in this video, let's take a look, guys, at Nvidia and AMD. Oh yeah, a Nvidia is above now six hundred dollars, guys. We'll take a look at price action. Is it going to seven hundred dollars? Let's talk all about that, and then definitely AMD also. We can see is up six point nine percent, pretty much seven percent up today, and eleven dollars up, which is quite massive for a price like Nvidia, which is usually you know trades around that range of a hundred to two hundred dollars. But yeah, all time high. So let's cover some of the things, and then we'll jump into the price action. So here we go. Chipmakers hit record high on ASML boost. So, and they go over, um, you know, this is a Philadelphia Semiconductor Index, SOX, the rise 2.1% to hit all time high. And this goes all in all the report across all other um, chips. So, chip sector gets a boost after Europe ASML report surge in quarterly orders and better than expected Q4 results. So, all in all, um, you know, all semiconductors are going up based off of sentiment, but as we say, technicals are always important, and I consider them higher above than you know the the news in itself or any recommendations that comes because when things are already setting up technically for a direction or bullishness, and in case of Nvidia, parabolic the technicals are going to favor that, right? So it's not that if um, there, there is always the element that price action takes precedence. Now, earnings calls a little bit different of a different story, right? Um, which usually depends what they're going to say, but Wall Street usually price in the sentiment. But then earnings calls, when we'll cover Tesla today, you will get to know more about what earnings calls really does to the stock price. So here's another article. AMD gets another upgrade. And why an analyst says the stock could quadruple? Well, <laughs> so that's the thing now, right? When things starts ripping up, price targets goes astronomically high to the space. And then, um, yeah, things like quadruple. So that means $800 is what they were saying to AMD, right? Let's say, let's see what the article says. Um, AMD shares have spiked 20% since the start of the year amid a surge of optimism about the outlook for the company's opportunity in chips used for artificial intelligence. We all, all know that stuff. And on Wednesday, AMD shares extended their rally, jumping blah, blah, blah. New Street Research Pierre Ferragu raised his AMD rating to buy, to buy from hold with a 215 price target. That follows Tuesday's bullish call by Red Bush, who made you know raised their two hundred dollars. Where's quadrupling stuff going on here? Um, twenty twenty seven. I think they are projecting for twenty twenty seven. It may quadruple again. That's the direction they're heading towards. But anyways, guys, let's jump into technicals because um, look, until twenty twenty seven, we really don't know what the scene would be like. So we have to work with the technicals make our money today tomorrow or in a couple of months and play around that so talking about nvidia first as you know that just because rsi is overbought doesn't mean it's gonna reverse you know if you have been following my videos you know until and unless price session doesn't confirm anything these overbought positions doesn't mean anything NVIDIA is above 20, 50, and 200 days moving average. It is parabolic since the time we started talking about it that it's going to go parabolic. At 494, we started talking about that we got that breakout. We covered even right over here that, hey, it's just, it's just a parabolic move. We covered over here as well yesterday that it's still a continuation of a parabolic move because it was just cooling off here, right? We talked about this on the hourly interval, and today we are seeing a, again a breakout. Is this time to short NVIDIA? I would advise against that. You just never know where the top is, guys. This thing has price targets of $1,000 as well. So when, you know, and many short sellers, I'm pretty sure, are getting uh, bombastic, whatever the word is. <laughs> but anyways, uh, try, I, I'm just trying to be uh, you know, funny here. But um yeah, many, many short sellers are guys uh, caught up into it pretty sure and this you know also fuels up that level. Let's actually um, go back up here and let's 
actually take a look at short volume person that's what i just wanted to see yesterday what was the scene like on the short side so it's 28 27 not as high as 30 plus like 31 32 but still it's uh as it's owned by institutional investors and nvidia already is in the parabolic move you know it is in the parabolic move if i start seeing short sellers and again above 30 percent then you know there's a thing we can talk about either it's gonna squeeze out more if those levels break or it may start coming starts to cool off but so far i'm not seeing any use of short percent on nvidia in terms of price action let's take a look at hourly interval guys um and again like there is no sign of bearishness right like uh we are above all-time highs today's level as guys it's going into all-time highs today's levels will show up in a couple of you know give it some time okay the levels will show up but right now this is going all-time high here um and it has no sign of guys no sign of bearishness I, I am i gonna buy here no the place to buy are at these moving averages so 20 moving averages for example when it gave this confirmation you can see price came down found support you start seeing green candle and i, I can show you actually how to day trade this nvidia let's go to the five minutes interval and things will start getting clear and yeah for example let me turn on my day trading bot as well for you guys and you can see that left hand side is the data yeah nvidia guys even just trading with the bot is being massively awesome as well the green 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 profits again my bot there will be lot losing days as well guys i take guarantee of nothing just so you know um yeah but i'll show you how to do day trading as well with my using indicators and bots and if any of this stuff interests you guys, my links are in the description below of this video uh, for the memberships and you will have access to my indicators, my day trading bot, even Wall Street alerts that I have under premium like price targets, upgrades, downgrades, insider trading news and sentiment. My Discord link is in the description below as well and if you happen to join for six months, you have also a discount to take. So, all right, let's go back to the video. Now, I was gonna tell you about how to potentially day trade such moves so you have to have two charts open i always suggest have two charts open or you can just use my you know indicator that i also have this universal indicator but uh, you have to have one chart at higher interval one chart at the smaller interval but if you're just trading using one you know interval like let's say five minutes where my day trading bot also works but this orange day trading levels plus line that you see now, when you see a price action confirmed with this trend line that is going green and you see these wicks forming at these important double stacked support levels of orange lines and then you see these, uh, you know, green lines forming, right? Sorry, green candles forming. You ride the wave to the upside, guys, right? And when it starts consolidating, you start taking position out, right? And then you can see today we even found a second leg up from 20 moving average and we are heading higher so just trade with the levels guys use my indicators that's that's all what you need so guys nvidia is parabolic is it gonna go to 700 dollars well <laughs> if it keeps going parabolic yeah it will go to 700 dollars uh that's where the next psychological level is or 650 so but yeah there's no stop to it right now you know sky's the limit don't worry about rsi is overbought rsi can still cool off if nvidia for a few days does zigzag RSI will still come down, <laughs> but it, this does that parabolic moves end? No, and video can still go up. So what I'm trying to say is that you can't just trade out. You, RSI is useless unless you really know how to play it with the price action and the sentiment. All right, RSI itself doesn't mean anything. Okay, and so are the other indicators. You have to use price action is the king. Okay as we talk about five minutes, hourly interval, and all of that. So NVIDIA is in an uptrend, is in a parabolic move, okay? Doesn't matter if RSI is overbought. All right, let's go to AMD. Um, and AMD, guys, is also at all-time highs. This thing has another level up there. It's not showing up because I have adjusted. Because when I do different stocks, guys, I adjust these timelines of the levels based on where, which stock I'm looking at. So, um, 
here we go I got the AMD up here and let's go so AMD found support yesterday and at the all-time high previous all-time high went up and is breaking another level which will for now show up on hourly interval and AMD is bullish this was the area I was talking about if AMD goes above 174.67 cents guys it's it's still gonna continue to the upside and you know if you yeah and downside play was pretty much below 160.41 cents that never came um let's go to the hourly interval first um and let's talk about that yep no sign of bearishness well again it's not, i would say this is the time to take profits for the day the entries are right around these areas where you see moving averages converging or not just moving average let's go five minutes i'll show you how to trade similarly you have the direction with you you use the levels it's finding support and then you see this um you know uh, the candle falling and then you see next candle green you know giving you a confirmation of you know these that the sellers are not there it's just the liquidity grab and then it's shooting up so just trade with these levels guys orange lines and then until you don't see consolidation which on amd is not coming yet well there is this consolidation you can take some out here and then rest your ride up there right so this is with amd guys well this is it for this video guys I hope you found it helpful and valuable. If you did, please hit the like and subscribe, and I'll see you in my next videos, guys. Take care. Bye.